Roman cars. I clung to this world for too long before I cast it aside as a failed experiment. Don't tell me you're getting sentimental. I spent centuries here. You cannot imagine what I created. This is the empty husk I left behind. But the Sith could still be a useful tool to help you seize the Eternal Throne. Honored guests, welcome to Dromund Kass. Moff Lorman. It's Minister Lorman now. Really? I figured your career was over after you lost the Ascendant Spear. This story sounds too good to pass up. Back in my SIS days, I may have blown up a prototype Sith warship. Lorman was the deputy commander. It's Minister Lorman, and the past is irrelevant. I serve Empress Asina now. She awaits us in the throne room. Welcome, Commander. These are strange times. Once we would have been on the same side. Now we negotiate as strangers. I didn't expect to be on Droman Kars again. I can imagine. Much has changed for the better since you were last here. I urge you not to be so critical, Empress. The Sith Empire has always been glorious. I would like to continue this conversation on my personal shuttle. Just the two of us, speaking freely. It may not be wise to split up. I'm choosing to put my faith in her. Stay with Lorman and behave yourselves. It's Minister Lorman! Minister Lorman! Is that so hard to remember? Don't worry about us, Commander. Sith who do not approve of the alliance I offer. They hold tight to the old ways. But to stop Valen, we must work together. Taking her down is all that matters. I welcome any help I can get. This does not end with Valen. We both know there is only one path to victory. You want to seize the Eternal Throne, and I will help you. Why me? You don't want the throne for yourself. I am focused on the survival of my people. Unchecked, Valin will grind us into dust. I am not powerful enough to stop her. You are, with my help. Engine's non-responsive. We need to bring it down. We're coming in too fast. Bail out! Your skills are impressive, Commander. It's good to know your reputation is not exaggerated. That crash was no accident. My vessel was sabotaged. Probably the same person jamming our comm signals. Lawman's behind this. I know it. Lawman lacks both the courage and competence to orchestrate a direct attempt on my life. My shuttle has an emergency beacon. The signal should cut through any interference. If help is coming, that's where they'll be. Just about into the main network. Someone's coming. Forgive the intrusion, but I come bearing tragic news. The Empress's shuttle has crashed. Crashed where? 
somewhere in the jungle. Unfortunately, the emergency locator is not transmitting. That's... Uh, that's impossible. Not if the shuttle disintegrated. I'm afraid there's only one logical conclusion. The Empress and Commander are dead. Slogging through the forest to hunt you down was going to be the worst part of this job. It's so much easier when the targets come to us. You must know who we are. Do you really think you can beat us? The Geno Harridan fear no one. Not even you. The Geno Harridan? I thought you were just a myth. That's because we never leave witnesses. The beacon destroyed, comm signal still jammed, and a fierce storm coming our way. Even the weather is trying to kill us. We could take refuge in the Geno Haridan camp if we can find it. It's likely the camp is heavily guarded. It won't be once we're done. Looks like the storm's not letting up anytime soon. I say we grab a shuttle and head out now. The interference will disable comms and scanners, not to mention the risk of an electrical surge frying our circuits. Sean, I just heard the news. Let me express my sincere condolences. SIS reporting has gone downhill since I left. The commander is missing, not dead. Don't let foolish hope blind you. You are leaderless, as are the Sith. Someone must step in to fill the void. Forgive me, but aren't you the former Republic Chancellor? You've already served your term. True leaders don't need titles to hold power. I want what your leader wanted, to defeat Valen. Join me, and we can finish what he started. Pass. I've had more than my fill of working with you. You're still grieving. Eventually, you'll realize I'm right. Storm be damned. The time for patience is past. Let's find the commander. I suppose a shuttle was too much to hope for. I found something. It's not enough to simply crash the shuttle. I want to see the bodies. No bodies, no bonus. Chancellor Suresh. That Republic snake. I should have known Suresh was behind this. I've heard rumors she was working with the Geno Haridan. I had my suspicions. Suresh may no longer be Chancellor, but she maintains control over the Republic. Into the temple! I'm sure there's another way out. Looks like we have some exploring to do. Lead the way, Commander. Reports from Drome and Cass claim the Outlander is dead. No. Father's spirit is still rattling around in there. His little 
pet is alive. The truth is irrelevant. The rumors have thrown the Alliance into disarray. Now is the perfect time to strike. Odessan is too heavily defended. That doesn't change just because their precious outlander is missing. Odessan is not the target. Another Sith Lord. I once thought these ancient temples held the secrets to immortality. I was wrong. Many Sith have been able to escape death. For a time. But none have achieved as true a mastery of death as I have. Emperor of the Sith was my first face. But it is merely one of many I have worn. Clearly you weren't satisfied just being the Sith Emperor. The Sith Empire was too corrupted for me to save. But Sakul, Sakul was different. I saw potential in the primitive world, so I raised it to perfection. I see plenty of flaws in Sakul. The glory of the Eternal Empire has been tainted by my children. But it can be restored. When you take the throne, you will understand. We still need to go deeper if we hope to find another passage to the surface. Baywan, now's not a good time. This can't wait. Suresh just sent a message. She's heading here, to Odessan. Seems she didn't wait for us to change our minds after all. Send her pack in the second she lands. Some of the troops want to hear her out. They aren't sure the Alliance can last. There are rumors about the Commander. Remind them where their loyalties lie. Stall Suresh. We're on our way. Minister Lorman warned us you might sneak off. Don't you know it's rude to make me come out in a storm like this? We should just seal the passage behind us, trapping you in here forever. Not an option. Suresh wants the corpses. No bodies, no bonus. So you traded groveling to Asina for groveling to Suresh. You're pathetic, Lawman. It's Minister Lawman, and I don't answer to Suresh. We're partners. You'll die the same as her. You should have surrendered, Lawman. It's not Lorman's call. The Geno Harridan always finish the job. Stay back! I've taken your friends hostage! Anything happens to me and they're dead! This is Minister Lawman. Let me speak to the prisoners. Oh, hello, Lawman. This is who you sent to capture us? I'm a little offended. You started the killing without me. We can't let you have all the fun. It's good to hear your voice. I knew you weren't dead. Never doubted it for a second. I couldn't leave the Alliance in the hands of you two, could I? It's not us you should be worried about. 
Suresh wants the Alliance, Commander. She's on Odessa as we speak. Hold tight. I'm on my way. You are my guest. Would you like to execute the traitor, or should I? I've got a better idea. Slap a shock collar on him. Let others see what happens when they oppose you. That is a truly excellent plan. Members of the Alliance, as many of you have already heard, your commander is dead. There are dark times ahead, but fear not. I have come to offer you a beacon. I assume you know everything, then. I'll take that as a yes. It doesn't matter. The Alliance needs a leader like me. I saw an opportunity and I took it. I won't apologize for that. We are well beyond apologies. What do we do with her? Execution, I expect. It's what Valen would do. It's what I would do. And it's exactly what you deserve. Is it wrong to say I enjoyed that? Empress Asina is waiting for your call, Commander. We'll meet you in the war room. I apologize for everything on Droman Cuss. But I still believe we should unite your people with mine. You've proven yourself, Asina. I accept your offer. That doesn't mean you're home free. We're watching you. Enough! If this is going to work, we all need to trust each other. I, uh... Right. Sorry, Commander. I hope to prove you can count on the Empire. I look forward to working with you. the gravestone. We got your back, Radala. You okay? I've taken heavy damage. Need to make emergency repairs. Roger that, Radala. We'll bring your freighter on board. Just hold tight. Much appreciated, Koth. Looking forward to meeting you in person. <laughs> 